Welcome everybody back to another FC 24 foot draft video and it is over. The Copa America just finished, the UEFA Euros just, or not UEFA, but the Euros 2024 are done. And yeah, Spain ended up winning. Um, deserved win. They were undefeated. They haven't lost a single game. I think that they definitely deserved the win over England. Um, but yeah, that's just the end of the Kane's cursed. He's not going to get a trophy ever in his life. Um, maybe with Bayern next season. Who knows? It depends how many people leave from Bayern Leverkusen. But uh, yeah, we have uh, Spain winning. We also have Argentina winning. And Messi got subbed out in the 60th minute, I believe. He was hurt at the f in the end of the first half and then ends up leaving the 60th minute and gets uh, substituted for Nico Gonzalez. And then Lautaro actually gets subbed on and they win the game with his game-winning goal. So, um or he gets subbed on in like extra time. But anyways, he ended up scoring the goal. I always knew when he got subbed on, I knew he was scoring. So Spain and Germany both win. Lamine Yamal and uh, Messi end up winning. So a little bit of Barca bias there. But anyways, guys, footy's over. Now we're on to FIFA. Team of the tournament's out. Um, 99 Messi's in there. And I think we're going to start with a 3-4-2-1. And let's get ourselves Messi right away. No Messi. But we take a 91 Stefan. And then at center forward, hopefully we get ourselves a Messi. I'm not going to take Messi just because, like I said, there's a 99 Messi out there. A Kenny Dalgleish is out there as well. Do we take this Cruyff? I think we take this Cruyff just because it's an icon. And I think it's a little easier to get. We'll take a Bees Leaves 95 rated. We'll take a... Oh my days, this is a really good start. Pierre Lowe as well. A Fratesi? I think we take him. That's a no-brainer, I feel like. And then we're looking at Gavardio, who I'm going to take for the chem. And we have a pass. I don't know how you say that. Sorry, I don't know how to say that. pronounce their name. And then a non rare gold. And we're back up to Peter Schmeichel there. And then our Nick Pope is the backup keeper. All right, here we make the choices. Hmm. No one can play right mid. No one can play left mid. Goosens can play left mid, but... None of these cards can play center back, so I think we take the rating there on a battle. Kafu can't play right back. He, she can't play right mid. We'll take Kafu as well for the bench. We'll take a Xavi Alonso, 95. That's his highest rated card he can get. And then we can't... We, so we need a better center back for sure. A 93. They can play a lot of positions. We'll take him. Benzi Almiron could play right mid. I think we take Miron for the cam and also can play right mid and it's a higher overall. So I think it's a good choice. Mm, 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 mm. Don't freeze. We'll take Marta, highest rated there. And then I think we take a Trossard, right? Center forward, cam, striker. They play like the same positions. So I think we take Trossard. And put him in over Eusebio, right? Yeah, that'll work. And then we take... We're not going to take Jude. I think we take Gioro. Because Francescoli has a higher rated card. And Jude has a higher rated card. We take Gioro. Let's organize the bench real quick. Okay. Oh, there's the Puskas we needed. A higher rated card right there. So we really just need a center back. And we don't get it. And we're not going to get the right chem. Or, um, sorry, not chem, but uh, rating. So, we were close there. Uh, just couldn't get the rating. Uh, we were, like, what, two, three points off? Um, two points off, I guess. So, that was our first entry. Let's go ahead and get started into our second entry. All right, we're back with the second draft. And I think we're going to do a 4-3-2-1 this time. I think wingbacks are really important. Or, sorry, fullbacks are really important for the higher rating. And we don't get a good start. Hmm. Do we take someone that can actually fit into the team? Because it would be Cruz. But Cruz has... He has like two really high rated cards. I think we take Jan Hansen because she she has the team of the year, I guess. So maybe we start out off bad there. We'll take a Drogba. We'll take a Croy for sure. And this is where it gets tough. Do we take Francescoli or Benz? I think we take Benz. Because Francescoli has a higher rated card. In general. Mm, we'll take Padre, Barca, Spain. Oh, Zizu there. No, we're not going to take the ball. We'll take Nicola Barella there. We'll take a Kyle Walker. 
Oh my gosh. Okay, here we go. We got to think about this. Actually, no thinking. I think it's cumin. The rating. Desai. Drocancelo. Allison. Oh no, wait. I went to the wrong spot. Ooh, Kerr. Or Francesco for the chem. Do we risk it? I think we take Francesco for the chem. I know it's only two rating points less, but I think the chem's really important there. Okay, backup keeper is kind of whack. Left back. We can take Konate. It's, nope, we can't really use the center back. Ooh, oh, wait, we can't play CDM. Kyle Walker can play center back in this switch. Okay, watch this play right here. Watch this play right here. Hold on. A 92 right there. Switch these two right there. Take this IE, put in Charles. Look at the... That was that was a smart play right there. I better get a like on the video for just that play I did. Oh my days. 98 Zizou. Playing next to the 96 Zizou. The foot draft is glitched right there. Oh, I shouldn't have taken Doku. He has a better card. Kukureya. Whatever can play center back. But we'll put him at left back. Okay. Kafu or... Okay. I think we take... Actually, it doesn't matter who we take between these two, right? Because no matter what, they're not going to be able to pull into the squad. So, we'll take Kafu. And then we'll take a... Mm -hmm. What do we need upgraded? We need, I guess, a center mid, right? A center mid, but it doesn't really matter because none of them are going to play center mid. Our last pick, a 94 Jimenez. And this is unfortunate because this, this was a good team, but it, was, it didn't really have the most special cards towards the end of it. A lot of gold cards, which is... This might have been the most gold cards I've had, you know, since, like, I don't even know, the start of the game. That's insane. Look how many gold cards. Three... Five. I think usually you get like what two rounds of golds. So this is a 127 rated squad. I don't think I can make it any higher than that, right? Even if I were oh reorganize the bench, I guess. Still not high enough, but a 127 squad on our second attempt. Not the worst, not the best. Obviously, you gotta get closer to 128, 129, but let's go ahead and get into our third and final attempt of the video. All right, guys, so from the actually uh, joining and quitting my game to restart the draft, I actually did get a draft token, which has been a while. I think it's been like 10 or 12 drafts since I've gotten a free draft token. So EA, man, make that a little more common. But I think we're going to, yeah, I think we do the 3 4 2 one to end off for a third and final attempt. Oh, I was really hoping for a, I was really hoping for a, uh, a Messi there. We'll take a Cruyff. I know he has a Thunderstruck, but. I think we got to take what we got to take right now. We'll take a Holland as well. And then we take uh, Usabio. And then we go to the left mid. Let me know down in the comments what you guys thought about the Copa America and the uh, Euros overall. I think it started off slow. Um, oh, sorry. The first game was... Uh, who was the first game? Like the first game of the... I think it was like Scotland versus... I'm so bad at remembering things, but... Um, I thought it was gonna be like a really good tournament when when Spain beat Croatia the first their first game three 0 and I was like okay Spain's kind of nice right you have Jamal Nico kind of cooking up Fabian Ruiz and then later on we find out Danny Olmo is like the greatest player on earth so I'm happy for him that he actually you know gets a little bit of uh, silverware for himself um but I thought overall the Euros were really good um oh sorry not the Euro I think the the um the Euros were kind of a letdown I was expecting kind of more but I don't know. I just think there should have been like way better games. There's a few good games during the group stages, maybe like two or three. But uh, I mean, other than that, I felt like I don't know. I think overall it was good. Uh, I think, uh, there's a lot of or there was a lot of upsets. Um, like Hungary was upsetting some teams. Not Hungary, sorry. During the group stages, um, who do we take here for right mid, or do we take a left? Okay, so we have a we have wing backs here, but we're playing three at the back, and no one can play the midfield. So I think we just take a full highest rated card, and then we just move on, and then we'll take a Bruno. 
right? Yeah, Bruno. Put him over there. Boom. Gets the chem up. And then we take a Conte, team of the tournament. We finally get some new cards. Okay, our, our, our chem goes down a little bit. But we take a Puskas. Beautiful. Replaces Eusebio. Boom. And then we take a Puteas because Cruz and Messi have better cards. And then we take an Araujo, I believe. Okay, so right now we're looking good. I think we're looking pretty decent on rating. We just need real... Or sorry, Cam. We just need really high-rated cards right now. Our Marco Royce. He fits, but he doesn't help with Cam. Benzema for birthday wouldn't help with Cam either. Argentinian from the Prem. So we need... Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Let's really think about this. I think I take... Because Royce can play center forward and he can go in where Cruyff's at, but then what we have, we'll lose more chem. And then Benzema is just not going to give us any chem. Garnacho could play left mid, but our player gets full chem. I think we take Royce. And then do this. Then do that. I might have been a dumb choice. I'm not too sure yet. Uh, Bonmati or... I think we take Lauren James because... She's English and Prem, so. Oh, man. I feel like I kind of messed up somewhere. I'm not going to lie. We just, Okay, we need to get Kim back. There's Benzema's back. All right. That was a really bad last draft attempt. I can't even lie to you guys. That was pretty bad. A 93 in there for a 92... Hmm. And now we need a French manager or... Well, actually, I mean, I guess that's true. We don't even need that. So we end off the video with a 127-foot draft. Um, No 128s today. Not even flirting with 129. So it is what it is. But that was my three draft attempts. Let me know your guys' thoughts on the Euros, on the Copa America. Who you guys' uh, you know, player of the tournament was for each. Um, and yeah, uh, next video is going to be probably of champs rewards. I have only a few games left, about four or five to finish. And then a ton of uh, objective packs, uh, SPC packs are going to be all opened up for the team of the tournament rewards. So if you guys want to see that, like, like the video, subscribe, but for now, I'll see you guys in the next video. Adios.